For the Beaver Radio Network, I'm Brian Schultz, BSU softball team, fresh off of a trip to Myrtle Beach, South Carolina, joined by freshman outfielder Angie Roberts. Congratulations on a great trip. Thank you. you guys went 7-3. Uh, and three. Um, Did you get everything worked on while you were there that you guys wanted to get worked on or not? Um, yeah, it was really nice getting to play with the weather, wind, and sun. We got to work on a lot of sun balls in the outfield, which was a little tough sometimes, but... It's nice to get the kinks worked out before conference play. How different is it, if you can even put it into words, it, practicing at the rec or at the John Glass on artificial turf compared to actually taking a real fly ball outside? It's a lot different. I was pretty nervous coming into it, but we've been playing the game our whole lives, so it's just the same game, different pace, but just got to remember, same techniques, everything's the same. Off the field, how was the trip? It was really fun. I got to know a lot of the girls a lot better. We got to hang out, go to the boardwalk, beach. All of our games were early, so we had the whole day after that. Uh, how much better can you learn uh, what your teammates are like and what their likes and dislikes are? Because it's got to help you on the field uh, when you're actually spending all day with them as opposed to a couple hours of practice. It's really easy. Like I think we bonded a lot better on our trip, so now – it's a lot easier to support each other on the field and off the field. I know what makes people tick and what makes them laugh. So a strikeout, just say something to them, get them back in the game. You've played in all 16 games so far. As a freshman, did you anticipate playing this much this early? I did not. I came into it. I didn't think I would get much playing time. I was ready to fight for a position, but it's been really nice getting the games and it's been a lot of fun. What Obviously, you, you had to be successful in practice to have the confidence of the coaching staff, but uh, how long did it take you to get used to things? A couple of weeks. Coming into it, the first week, I was really, really nervous. Um, it was a lot different than high school. Everything was a lot more fast-paced, a lot more work had to be put into it every day. But after the first two weeks when we started doing a lot of drills with outfield mainly, I got to know a lot of the girls, and it was just a lot easier. I would assume that playing high school softball in the outfield would be fairly similar to college outfield. I would guess the biggest change would be in the batter's box. How much better are the pitchers at this level? They're a lot better. The first scrimmage of the year, we played Moorhead, and I watched a strike go by me. I struck out, and I said to my dad, I've never seen a pitch like that. I don't even know what that pitch was doing. But we hit off of our pitchers, who are great pitchers, and it helps us a lot for the games. You guys are supposed to open up conference play next week. There's still a couple feet of snow out there. Uh, any idea when you guys might get out uh, and be able to play? Hopefully next week. The football field's been shoveled off, so if worse comes to worse, we'll use that. But we're really hoping for next week. Your parents both came here. How much influence did they have on your decision to come here? Um, quite a bit. They didn't pressure me to come here, but it was the first school I toured, and I just fell in love with the campus. Best of luck this year. Thank you.